Hey guys, here we just unboxed our iPad Mini, so let's jump right in. This device is 5.3 inches wide, feels very good in hand, 7.9 inches tall, very lightweight, 0.68 of a pound. Uh, yeah, you can hang, you can dangle that by, you know, by a keychain there, guys. Really lightweight, very nice device. Feels very premium in the hand there. We got Gorilla Glass on the front, all aluminum chassis, the Apple logo here polished into the aluminum. Um, we got, on the bottom, we have our lightning uh, charge port. That's a new thing for Apple with the, the new iPads and new iPhone 5 as well. On either side of the lightning uh, uh, charge port right there, there are stereo speakers. We have two speakers there. So yes, it is stereo. And then up top here, we got a 5 megapixel uh, eyesight camera that's capable of shooting um, high definition of video. All your buttons and switches on this are aluminum as well. There's no plastic here. It's a very premium, very premium feeling uh, product. Like I say, uh, Gorilla Glass here on the front with the oleophobic coating. Uh, right here is a 1.2 megapixel eyesight front face and camera. You can shoot uh, 720 HD uh, video with that as well. Screen resolution on, on this is the same as the uh, iPad 2, which is 1024 by 768. That's 163 pixels per inch. But this is going to fall somewhere between, uh, as far as picture quality, uh, viewing quality, between the iPad 2 and the iPad uh, third generation. Because, you know, the third generation is, of course, Retina. But because this is a smaller shrunk down screen with a 1024 by 768, you're going to get uh, a higher pixel count just because due to the screen size being smaller there. Um, also, you have the A5 processor in this, which is an iPad 2 processor. But, uh, you know, benchmarking this, you're really not going to notice, notice the difference. Um, this is really a nice, very premium product. It was very good in the hand. Uh, primarily, I'm going to be using this for an uh, e-book reader, and, as I already have an iPad 3. But, yeah, I would highly recommend going out and getting one of these, guys. It's a really nice little device. Go out and check that out. Get one in your hand, and um, you'll walk out of the store with it, I guarantee you.